Hey everybody, welcome back to the Professor Duggar. I hope you're having a great day. Today's video, I got one more box of Topps Mini. I think this is box number five. Um, some stuff that was just sitting in the closet. So let's go ahead, let's open this up. Let's see what we can get out of it. Should get three parallels and two inserts. Let's see how we do. Uh, last box had a red insert out of five. That was kind of neat. Of course, it's because this is all like 990 cards. We didn't get one that was that good, but that's all right. We'll see what we can get out of this. So you get 35 cards, and then um, of those 35 cards, uh, three of them are in two inserts and then three parallels. Uh, there's just one unannounced parallel, which is a black parallel, which I think has a print run of around 10. But uh, there's pinks and blues, reds, and platinum. Platinum is the uh, one of one. So you can also get autos in this, so we'll see how we do. Um, we'll see how we do. Uh, main thing we're looking for, like Bobby Witt and J-Rod. In this, we got a blue, a pink, and a pink. So um, the blue, I believe, is out of 10, and I think the pinks are out of 25. I don't remember. Yeah, I think the pinks are out of 25. All right, well, we'll see. Let's see if we can get a decent rookie or a couple stars out of this. Here's Aaron Ashby. Riley Adams, Casey Mize, Anthony Rendon, Brandon Woodruff. Here's our first for the Pirates, JT Brubaker. So, yeah, this is the consequence of having 990 players. One out of ten, but it is JT Brubaker. No. We'll still put it, well, at least still sleeve it up. Maybe the pinks will be a little better. There's Charlie Barnes, Brandon Lowe, MJ Melendez. That's a decent run. Hey, look at that. J Rod. Since it's so hard to kind of pull anything decent out of this, anytime you get like, you know, like I got a Shohei, I got a Trout. J-Rod, for example, that's a good pull, um, just because it's hard to pull any individual thing out of this. And next up is for the Chicago Cubs, Clint Frazier. And that is one out of 25. All right. Let's see what else? There's a future stars. There's the Brewers team card. William Domus and Christian Yelich. Cleveland. There's that guy. And unfortunately, not going to be playing anymore. And for the Angels. Well, that's a decent one. I like that. There you go. MVP caliber. And that is numbered two out of 25. That's that's a nice card with oh, Otani. And Mike Trout. And look at this, we got an SSP. Or, I don't remember these. They have no, it's just a short print, but it's one in ten, so that's not too bad. And then we got Hunter Green on the eighty-seven insert, but David Ortiz short image variation, short print. I'll take that. I don't mind that. So nice box overall. We got the J Rod rookie. Yeah, he didn't have a of a year as everybody hoped but um, we did get one good 
parallel, the Angels team card with Otani and Mike Trout. We got the David Ortiz short image variation, the Brubaker out of 10, the Clint Frazier out of 25. Um, I at least got a couple Brewer cards for my liking, but uh, yeah, fun stuff overall. You know, it wasn't super expensive. I think they were 20 a box when I bought them or something like that, so, um, but still fun to open. So what do you think about 2022 Tops Mini? Is that something that should try to bring back? Bring that back for like 2024 um, with all the rookies that they have? That would be kind of fun to bust open, especially if they kept it reasonable. Let's just jump it up to like 30 a box, given it's 2024. But um, yeah, fun stuff. Um, so feel free to leave a comment below. Go ahead, hit that like and subscribe button right down there. Thanks for watching, everyone. And I will see you later.